we're back for more Bloodborne. I've done some exploring around Hemwick. <coughs> I hate that stupid bean gets caught in the back of my throat. Sorry. Um, and so far as I can tell, all roads lead to that witch fight. So I couldn't do much, but I did find a part of the shortcut that I was missing unlocking. So... As with the previous two Bloodborne streams, we're starting tonight with a boss. Yeah, yeah, I know. You're upset. I understand. I don't like these Molotov guys. They suck. Alright, let's keep moving. This was the gate I had to figure out to unlock. Which is right around the corner. Now, hopefully, I'll get to figure out what the crap she's doing when she did that thing where she stun locked me and one of the, her little wolves killed me to death. I hate it! Really? Hit me in the back with a Molotov? Yes, that is the goal. Wow. All right, this one's still an audio ow. I didn't know it would actually attack manually. All right, there it goes, there it goes. Potato-wise. So anyway, how's everyone's Friday been? Ah, oh, crap. Get out of there. Alright, you gotta listen for it. Oh, I didn't even hear it there. Yeah, you're gonna disappear again. Go ahead and disappear, see if I care. Awesome! So it does let me hit it twice. Summons a whole whack load of friends and it still stuns me. I don't understand. Move! Let me move! Oh, come on. I love how everyone's like, this boss is easy, and I'm like, yeah, I'm, I'm sure it is. Okay, okay. We pissed in your Cheerios. Relax, dude. Ah, I knew I wasn't going to get that off. Okay. Wait. Alright, that witch is back to zero again. I don't understand. It's friggin' puzzle fights. Okay, I'll mute that in a bit. Oops. Oops was not close enough for that attack. Good for you, Fix. Okay. Now for the now for the run of shame. I still don't understand like how I'm supposed to hurt this other witch boss that's showing up. My goal is also to not lose blood vials reaching the boss. Oh. Uh-oh. 
Oh, he's friggin' blocking the way. Loser! Nothing wrong with a good staycation. Something where you just get to relax at home and not do anything. Sounds decent to me. What? I was rolling! Alright, I might have to just attack those guys every time. Oh. We got friends right away. Alright, let's get our blood echoes back and hopefully I don't sit down. Not that it's a lot of blood echoes. That was a good chunk of health. Ah, that does so much damage. I thought he was about to do that explosion thing again. You know, that thing. What? I bet. Commutes take it out of you, man. Like, I, I remember, um, especially when it gets so friggin' hot outside, when I got home from work, I, all I would want to do is just take a nap. Uh, fine. My primary goal on this fight is to relax. Getting worked up is what gave me so much trouble with Amelia a couple of or last stream. Yeah. Oh, well, that didn't, that didn't do much. No! Yeah, alright. Not that dude. I don't want to attack them. If I could get them down easy, they're worth a couple of blood vials. Is he still chasing me? Oh, he did follow me. Oh, crap. I'm about to die right here. All right. I've lost some health. Give me Pudget Blot. Uh. Yeah, so today was like trying to catch up day. Yeah, tomorrow's the big night. The last history stream for a little bit. Closing off the French Revolution. Alright. Let's go ahead and finish off this guy. I see you! Alright, that didn't damage him. Wait, was that a decoy? Alright, let's kill these two. I sure told them. All right, they're both dead. Eh. 
Dang it. I don't understand this fight. Alright, so now he's going to stun me. Or something. Oh, does he not stun me if there are no adds up? Is that the rule here? Oh. And he's got less health now. Screw you, sucker! Okay, that actually took some health off of him. Alright, just keep up with the ads, I guess. Keep up with the ads and whittle them down. I mean, I believe the story is like he's not hard. He feels more like a puzzle boss than anything else. It's just about figuring him out. He was about to hit me with another stun. Crap! Crap! Oh, crap! Okay, the bottom one got some health back. There goes that one. Come on, hit him again. Is that it? They done? Yeah! That was weird. Woo! Okay, what's down here? Your worst nightmare. Rune workshop tool. Oh, I need to return to the dream then, don't I? Oh, is this going to let me, like, upgrade runes and stuff? But so far as I can tell, there's nothing in, like, this particular area other than this. So I, I guess I need to just return to Central Yarnum and keep exploring around or something. Yeah, blah blah blah. Very well, let me. Uh, we'll do. Let's see what the rune workshop tool is first. Uh, I presume that does something here. What gem fortification? No. Perm's in, Perm's in uh, formal mood tonight. Mr. Lord High Fixer, what, what a pleasure it is to see you tonight. And the few were lost, but if one, yet the ten, it was yeah. burned. The perfect. Okay. He's not telling me anything about this gem thing. Alright, I don't have a ton of blood vials saved up. Um, at some point, I'm just going to have to, like, go grinding offline for blood vials to to store, but I'm good for now. i still got 21 in storage. Let's go ahead and upgrade something, rather than just carrying around 20,000 blood echoes. Strength! You are stronger! Uh... I've got to find a path I haven't found yet. Mm, mm -mm. I know where I got to go. There were like two split offs from the cathedral. I took one of them and we explored all that area. Um, I have not gone through the other. I think there's a second one there. Hang on. Uh, the get good store is out of business fix. At least that's what they tell me every time I call. Just 
just like Whataburger, huh? It was a sad day down here when Whataburger left Florida. It sucked. Alright. So now we're here. Hello, Mrs. Intent Rocket of the ninth variety. All right, so I took the one that's on the right. Let's check over here. I think Fix is just making sure his account is still in good standing with you, buddy. All right, I've not checked down here. What the... Whoa! Yeah. Oh my gosh. He is swift! Definitely not going for heavy swings on that guy. No, 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 no. Well, I think to a certain extent, one of the things that will be really fun about covering the Napoleonic Wars is kind of seeing France get its act together, if even only in the poorest possible sense under a dictatorship. Because, like, right now, it feels like Napoleon is the only one who really knows what he's doing at all, and the people who are going to become his marshals show some competency. But other than that, they're all like bumbling idiots or they're corrupt or what have you. Yeah. I mean, I'm not one to applaud a dictatorship of any kind, but it'll like there have been like eight separate occasions during this entire during this entire narrative where it has felt like France is like one stiff breeze could collapse France. France has no right to exist with all the crazy crap that it's gone through. All right, bring it, Saga. Ow! Oh, he's got a buddy. How nice. I love it when they bring their pals to play. Uh, okay. Yeah, I do. Not that weapon. Alright, I've brought out the whip. We're going Castlevania. Let's go. I love that when you come up behind them, they don't even really notice until it's too late for them to do anything about you. This run back sucks, sucks though. Holy crap, he's got health for days. I mean, the other good news about the uh, whip attack is that they do seem to stagger them enough when they connect most of the time. How much? How many blood echoes do you drop, good sir? 
3,400 blood echoes from that dude alone. I'm not certain I'm ready for this particular area. Now, where's his buddy who tried to come along to play? Ow! What the? He staggered me! I didn't know they could do that! Uh-oh. Haha, <laughs> you can't hit me. Stop staying ranged, it's rude. Okay, okay. I'm sorry, sir. I'm so about to die here. There are blood echoes on the ground. Oh no, don't get greedy, I'm getting greedy. All right, screw this dude. How do you... I can't even touch him! Yes! Damage! The damage is occurring! I can't believe it! Ow! My shots do friggin' nothing, Rocket. Watch. Oh, he dodges them too. Ooh, seven whole damage. Stop it! I don't know what to do about that guy. The relative difficulty of the fights, though, really does make me think I'm not ready for this specific area. I can upgrade it. Let's try that. I don't know if I've got the gems for it, but let's see. It's not a bad idea. I have all the weapons that the vendor sells. Um, I think at this point it's just a matter of upgrading them. No, he's out of town, I asked. I'm on my own today. Uh, let's go ahead... Oh. But of course, I'm not going to be able to fortify anything because I can't afford it. I can upgrade the gun, though. So we're definitely going to go do that. Uh, hang on one second. Just need some quick, uh, some quick blood echoes. Get to take you through a little bit of my uh, my most recent loop. Are you kidding me? I've been grinding between most of my streams. Yes, they're very, uh, very naughty. Yeah, I have been. Oops. Yeah, when I've got time, um, you know, I'll, I'll take like an hour aside or whatever and just 
do this loop while I've got like perm stream or YouTube or something going on in the background. I'm not getting a lot of blood echoes from this, uh, from the loop this time. I thought I was out of his Molotov range. Who doesn't fix? Who doesn't? Alright. Dodge his thing. I hate it when I knock him off like that. I know. Just can't believe it, can you? Alright, there's one over here. Let's deal with him first. This is probably more blood echoes than I need, but... ah, uh, You snot rag, come on. There you go. That's what I'm talking about right there. I'll kill him. And then we'll hit the lantern on the way out. They're also good for farming blood vials. out of here. I don't want to waste a blood vial because I'm about to just use the lantern to get out of here, which is free healing. So there we go. That's not even the full loop I was used to doing. It's 10,000. Yeah, generally when I got to, when I get to the place where I'm pretty close to a boss, or if I know like my next thing is going to be a boss and I've got like some time to spare... I'll just fire up Bloodborne and grind a little bit. Uh, right, right, right. Upgrading the weapons. Alright. Let's see what we can do with the pistol. Uh, well, first we need to... Uh, these aren't really damaged. I'm not worried about that. Fortify! Okay, I've got it up to plus three. I don't have enough of the twin blood shards to do more. All right. Uh, speed. Rocket suggested speed. I don't have enough blood echoes for it. Uh, ba -ba 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 -ba. All right. Back to the cathedral. So, out of curiosity, these guys, these ones that I'm having so much trouble with right now, am I poking ahead to a place I shouldn't be yet? Or is this legitimately where I should be going next? Because one of the things I really do struggle with in, in this game is getting lost. It's very confusing, and there are no in-game maps. Although I suppose everybody just learns Yarnum through repetition. Alright, I'm going to try and shoot this first dude just to see what the damage looks like. Oh, can I? Oh, I can shoot with the threaded cane extended. I couldn't do that with the axe because it's a two-hander. That's good to know. Uh, Where's lightning cane, dude? Is it just you? Oh, it does ten damage now. I challenge you, sir, to a duel. Woo! Oh, now he stabs.
what I'm trying to do is exp like if I get in close with him, he'll melee me, which is fine. I understand that he does so very quickly. But what I'm trying to do is get in close with him and try to stagger him if I can. But I find most of the time when I'm actually trying to stagger him, he still just shoots me point blank anyway. It's okay. It's called learning. Oh. Patience, patience. I am really surprised that Lightning Dude was not down there. The good news is that I I don't really use my gun a whole lot during the uh, during the blood uh, the the echo farm, so I've got a fair amount of bullets stored up. Oh, I'm sorry. I I should have uh, spoken in Vogonic poetry. How did he dodge that? Knew that was gonna be a swing and a miss. Ow. Ow. What? I I don't think I don't think my getting shot in the face repeatedly strategy is working out for me. <laughs> I did parry him though. It can be done! A valuable experiment. Well, you have to experiment with these things, Rocket. I mean, until you get shot in the face several times, how do you not know that it's... Or how do you know that it's not a valid strategy for success? It's game science, really. Good evening, fish! Finally got out of the airport, huh? Did they actually manage to put you up in a hotel someplace, or did you actually stay in a hotel the whole time? Just thought I'd shoot the building, you know, warm up my gun a little bit. Yes, but that means that I maintain hope for the future, Rocket. One of these times, it'll work, probably. Not this time, but maybe next time. Good. Oh, I dodged too early. I've stayed overnight in uh, the Atlanta airport. It sucks. Ah, you can't hit me around this tree. Oh, crap. I lost my lock on. Oh, those aren't my... Don't sit down. Hmm. Let me contemplate this the merits of a strategy that involves me getting shot in the face repeatedly. Stop shooting me! Good lord! He's gotta run out of bullets sometime. Uh-oh. Oh no! All right. No kidding, man. I'm not. All these guys are crazy difficult. 
And what I'm half expecting is that someone's going to show up at the end, or Fix has been holding on to this little fact in his back pocket that these guys are in game or something, and I shouldn't be fighting them for several more hours. I'm switching it up this time. I'm still going to die, but I'm switching it up. Not if the alternative was watching me suffer and get shot in the face several hundred times. Run past them? What am I, a, a wuss? Heck no. Oh good. I'm Aha. Oh boy. Let me heal. Uh-oh. Shoot me. Oh crap. <laughs> what are you going to do? Stab me? Guy who got stabbed. Come on. Come on. You know you want it. Come get it. Don't sit around the back like a wuss shooting bullets and stuff. Be a man. Oh, come on. Yeah! Dude dropped 10 bullets. I can't... Been a while since I've celebrated killing a trash mob. He was not kind... What the... What is that thing? Ooh. I do not like this claustrophobic cave. Terrific. Oh boy, oh boy. Oh, I'm dead. Oh. It's fine though. I know how to kill these guys. I just gotta learn the terrain and learn where all the threats are and yada yada yada. Please don't respawn those two jerk bags. Please. We are going to find out if it's fine in about a minute. If the game has respawned to either of those two guys, we're in trouble. Although, I think I got a strategy for him now. You dodge the gunfire into him to close the distance and get a few quick hits in. You can't, like, zigzag your way up to, it, up to him. He'll just shoot you the whole way. And then he'll stab you once you get close enough. I did not see that there were two of them up here. All right, that's definitely the better way out here. Ah. 
Ah, uh, yes. So glad that actually, like, uh, staggered him. Ooh! And you're out of here! Big Mean Green Machine steps up to the plate, takes a swing! It's a home run! I've done better. Yep. Yep. Done better. No, it was a home run for him. <laughs> oh. Okay. Well, hey. We learned how to how to deal with those two. Every every run we're learning something. So, believe it or not, this string of failures is success. Any engineer will tell you that failure is part of learning. So really, I might just be one of the smartest streamers around. All right. What is that? <laughs> Wait. <laughs> I can't show that on stream. All right. And this time we're going to grab this loot that I missed. Ooh. Wait, do these guys not re Okay, there they are. Good. Looks like Looney Tunes, too. Sucked pretty much. And he didn't drop any blood vials for me. What a jerk. Uh oh. Oof. Oh my gosh, look how much health he took off. Yeah, I see you skidding around there. Man, they dropped those twin bloodstone shards, though. They're creepy, but I kind of like them. Anybody home? Hello? 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 Oh, this feels like a boss arena, too. No? I'm shocked. Okay. What? Whoa! Um... Well, getting picked up and squeezed to death by a giant ghost skeleton is not what I thought was about to happen. Yeah, the potato eyes one is something that Rocket suggested, um, uh, specifically related to me and Dustin. Well, the door said it was closed, and then I got picked up and hugged to death. So 
So, I think that is the end of that path for me right now. Where else to go, though? I need to find something I haven't looked at yet. Let's look around down here. Uh, nothing. And nothing. Yeah, thanks. I'm sorry, did you happen to see a giant, a giant skeleton ghost wandering around when I didn't see it? I mean, I've fallen into that friggin' wormhole once before, but this was the first time it's actually been something physically holding me. I mean, I don't know where else to go. Tug a chat? What? I nearly killed you with that attack and you still got it off? Yay, blood vials! Woohoo! The crap, dude. Hold on, I want to kill that skittery thing. He's got he's got upgrade materials for me. Get your butt back here. That took way too many swings. I'm glad they don't seem hostile. Alright, I can't go down there. And Rocket says I'm not ready for this door. Nor did I find a way to open it. What I'm interested in knowing, and the reason I came down here again, was to see... If that thing kills me again, if that thing picks me up again, is it strong enough to kill me from full health? Alright. Skeleton dude picks me up. Oh. Yes. Yes, he is. Okay. So don't get picked up by that thing. Got it. How would I light it? In the, the only thing I have is to throw a Molotov at it. And I don't even particularly know how to aim the Molotovs that... that correctly. How about I don't, Skyer? And you go away. Thank you. The bots are back in town. Alright. I'll Molotov the center of the room and see what happens. Am I actually going to have to fight that skeleton thing? Is it going to actually, like, turn opaque for me and then I'll have to stab it in the feet like a thousand times to kill it? Yeah, they're cutting out all the fluff. It's just, do the thing we want you to do. It's all, it's, spam is always going to be a cat and mouse game for as long as spam exists. Which is not to exonerate Twitch, but... Um, <laughs> Julie, click the link! Um, but uh, every time a countermeasure exists, people will find a way to get around it. How did I not hit it with that? Okay, good, good, good. Oh, four blood vials. Oh, yeah. Yeah, give me all that bloody goodness. Ow. Not my blood! No, you've got to be freaking kidding me!
Yeah, yeah, it was kind of gross. I took a swing at the sentence. Didn't work. <laughs> you miss 100% of the shots you don't take. Oh, no. Oh, no. Those blue shells are BS, dude. The noble dress? No. No! I'm not wearing a dress in Bloodborne. I can't believe I ever entertained the notion for a second. I was like, a dress? Have I picked up a dress? Muy interessante. Alright. And then we kill these dudes, and then we kill the dudes at the bottom, and it's just a big old loop that we get to do over and over and over again. Oh, hi! Don't aim your gun at me. Didn't anybody tell you that aiming your gun at someone is rude and highly dangerous? You should cut that out. We're really good at swinging at each other at the same time. Why do they still get that attack off? No, not again. No, not again! Spoiler alert, it happened again. All right, all right. Uno mas. Uno mas, coming up! I'm so glad those two dudes didn't respawn, though. If they were going to respawn every time, I would not be exploring this. I'm a little surprised they didn't, though. Are they hunters? They look like they were dressed as hunters. Alright, and then down the path. This is giving me wild vibes all over again. You wipe, you take the, the walk of shame to get back to where you were. It's actually one of WoW's design elements that I did not like. I don't like it when a game wastes your time, and this feels like a waste of time. Sure told him. Alright, I'm running past you two. You're too dangerous, and I don't want to fight you right now. Alright. Are they actually going to follow me down here? No. Okay. Alright, let's throw a Molotov. I don't know how to aim it, but... Okay, that wasn't it. I don't see how I could aim any better than that. Um, none of this seems right. Blood gem. Use to gain a blood gem. Beckoning bell. Unlimited use. Part and ongoing and prevent further cooperation. This may shock you, I'm sure. I'm normally such a competent player. But I've not actually read all of the descriptions of these things. Wait. 
How's this work? Oh, I didn't know I could just switch between them like that. Oh, dude, I'm a moron. There's a torch! Yay! Uh... Dude, I had no idea! Okay. So set on fire that thing in the center. I am too smart. Nothing I is happening. Smart. I am too smart. I am too smart. S M R T. I mean S M A R. I had no idea there was a torch. Um. Dude, this is so helpful. I would have had this thing out forever ago. Don't anybody look at me. I'm a moron. Grouchy, no one cares. <laughs> okay, how are you? I never actually thought to try putting something into those other slots. Oh, can I open this door? I mean, this is just, this is a, just instinct, but I think the guy in there is not doing well. So I still don't know where to go. Stupid crows, get out of here. I love it. I can't believe it. I know everyone else is just like, Ugh, Gilly, you're a moron. Boop. Fine. I was coming down here anyway. Look, I know you don't want me here. I'm trying to leave. Okay, fine. It's only a game. How you have to be mad. Whatever. Baldy, pass me a sensor bean. What, do you think I'm just giving these away? Here is your jalapeno bean. Because I'm not. Well, <laughs> I'm still stuck with the I don't know where to go problem. I don't know how to open that door down there, which Rocket says I'm not ready for. So I'm left with no other option than to just explore. There are certain loops I know very well, um, so I don't have to explore those, but uh, that's not the right way. 
There is a path down here I never went down. I did explore the sewers. I didn't find any alternate paths down there. I might as well kill you fools. Get some blood vials for it. Dang, man. Throw them across the friggin'... Wait, what is this? Have I been this way? This just goes into that house, right? I think I've been this way. Yeah, okay, that's the bridge. Call the elevator up. Place, uh, this place may be a dilapidated hellhole, but at least the elevator is working. Alright, so I always turn left over this to go to, to Father G. I don't think I've looked at what's down here. Ah, the sewers are down here. That's, that's terrific. So glad I took the leap of faith. There's the boar that freaked me out my first screen. Wow. Rude. Ah, blood vials. It's not worth killing these guys. They don't drop much in echoes. I also don't like hanging out down here. The reverb sucks. Uh-huh. Oh, you can stop mid-ladder. This is actually a good place to kind of hang out if you need to pause for a moment. Oh, there they go. Bullets, give me vials. More coins. Lame. All right, we didn't... Let's go past, past Father G's place and see if he's got anything for us. Let's kill these two real quick. guys normally drop stuff for me too hey at least I'm getting some blood blood vial farming out of this because I felt like we did we we didn't really look around here that much we kind of just unintentionally fast-tracked it to to Vicar Amelia so I feel like this area I'm not particularly well familiar with just looking around Open that door. There's no other way out of here. I mean, I don't want to spend the next hour just looking around Yarnum. But, at the same time, I don't know where to go. So, yeah. Oh, we're back here. Awesome. Okay, so straight, in, straight ahead never had anything. It's got this dude around the corner here. Where is everybody? There are normally a bunch of crows and stuff around here, too. Why is everything despawned? Have a good night, Perm. Thanks for coming and hanging out. It is a rare pleasure to see you around, dude. I hope you have a good a good night and a good weekend. All right, maybe we can open this now. Oops. I'll keep your thanks. 
new friend. By never talking again. Can I open this now? Nope. There's no map. I know the loop off to the side extremely well. Because this this was my blood echo loop for Amelia. Oh, did I ever go down here? I don't know if I did. Maybe I did. Once. It wasn't part of my loop. Oh yeah, I did go down here once on stream. guys friggin' have health. So I'm definitely uh, not in over my head on this one. Alright, there's an item up here which tells me I never really looked around this room. Yeah, I see you over there. You thought you were just gonna stand off to the side like Freddy Krueger and I wasn't gonna see you? Hey, I am extremely proud of that Sig Run run. Sig, sig run, 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 a Sig Run run. Uh, the question is, how do I get up there? Can I climb this thing? I don't see a ladder. Man, I can't believe... But at the same time, completely believe that I had no idea until this late in the game that I actually had a torch I could pull out when I needed to. It makes me feel like an idiot, but at the same time is 100% on par. How do I get up there? Well, obviously not this way. Let's keep looking around. Magnifying glass. Aha. Uh -huh. So is there a side entrance to the building around here? Whoa! Okay. Dog's coming in hot. Ah, yes. I'll admit, ant burning completely came into mind for me, too. Sometimes you gotta indulge those eight-year-old uh, instincts. One thing that would also help, and I, I don't know the name of the mechanism, but there's a... Uh, there's a thing you can like bolt to your table or sometimes it just comes with a heavy base instead and it's these like flexible arms uh, that you can use to hold things up um, and it'll just stay in place wherever you put them um, I know Adam Savage uses them all the time but yeah Ooh. I has found a passage. Wrong lever. Hold on, I'm just I'm still just looking around. What is this? Yeah, it's really good for soldering. Yeah. Yeah. It's basically a substitute for your hands. 
And when it comes to like doing things that you need a lot of people holding things for, it's invaluable. All right, I know I could have jumped down there and been fine, but I just wanted to look around a little bit more. All right, let's see what's down here. Okay. This was it. Oh. Okay. Side passage. Is there any others? No. It was so dark, I almost didn't think it was a side passage. I thought it was just like a wall. Yeah, I see you. Oops. That's not what I meant to do. That is also not what I meant to do. I sure told that air what was what. One stone shard, that's great. Alright. We're tomb raiding, everybody. Screw those urns. Or vases, or whatever. Oh, and for the record, Rocket, you are 100% correct. I would not have seen that lever had you not pointed it out. Thank you. I know you know that, but I just wanted to state it for the record. What's down here? With all these big empty rooms, I just keep waiting for something horrible to happen. Oh, there's a lantern down here. That's not great. I mean, it is a new area. This town is long abandoned. Hunters not wanted here. Old Yarnum. Uh. Okay. I did. Turn back at once. Old Yarnum, burned and abandoned by men, is now home only to beasts. Then why turn hunters away? Turn back, or the hunter will face the hunt. You're not that strong. Old Yarnum. Cool. Alright, yeah, there's nothing in this room. Okay. I did get the lantern. Alright, I tell you what. Before we go explore around Old Yarnum, I'm going to take an AFK now. I'll be back in a few minutes. In the meantime, enjoy these clips. And then we'll see what awaits. Back into your old Yarnum we go. A -dee 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 -dee. Seems like such a happy place. A lovely place for a little, a little vacation cottage, don't you think? I am too smart. SMRT. I mean SMAR. You set up right down there next to the haunted manor or whatever. No problem. You'll always have company. <laughs> Although, I don't know. To me, that sounds like a horrifying prospect. There are plenty of times where I just want to be left alone. <laughs> well, there's no going back. That was a bunch of one-way steps down. Hi. What do you do? Ah, you die. Very informative. Thank you. Ooh. Wait, now, wait, what? 
I, I just have a torch. I put a torch on. What's the difference? Oh, I can attack with these things? Neat. I thought that stabbing forward motion was just to set things on fire. I didn't know enemies were among them. Hmm. I guess we keep going down. Well, like any art, it'll take practice. You know, don't don't be too hard on yourself if uh, it doesn't look right after the first few times. But I'm glad you're designed to try and pick up a new hobby. I hope it works out well for you, man. Hmm. This is a very roundabout, a roundabout route. That I hope to only take once. Uh, cold blood do. Woohoo. And we're back up here. Ta-da! Okay. Let's try another way down. Or across this bridge. One of the things I'm going to have to do is ident identify the loop here. Because there's no way that there's no boss here. Well, you're making it do something it's not used to doing. Oh, blood dude, terrific. Blood bile. For the record, I'm saving the, the do for when I need to do an upgrade like now and I cannot afford the time to do a loop. So that's like an on stream I've got to level right now kind of situation. Or like when I get to a new boss like first thing in stream and I know I got to level up. That's why I haven't touched them yet. I found out what they did and then I haven't touched them since. Bloodstone shard, cool. I mean, I suppose at some point I'm going to have enough of these little shards and whatever to, like, upgrade all of my stuff to plus 9 if I really want to. I think it's the plus 10 that's going to be a pain from what you are what I was being told earlier. Adept, huh? Oh boy. Oh, this isn't where I want to be. Let me out of here. I'm on fire. I am shocked I survived that. I was completely pinned in that stupid little hole. I love that guy's like giving me compliments while I'm just getting like swarmed in this little corner next to a fire and just like, you're so good at this game. Uh-huh. Whoa! Okay, I'm, I'm gonna look around here, down here a little bit. Alright. Open this. Ow, ow. Have a good night, Rocket. Thanks for hanging out. I hope you get to catch up on some sleep this week, and I know this week has got to have taken it out of you pretty bad. I don't know why you're shooting there. He's got line of sight to me. Ow! Alright. 
Given how quickly some of these monsters die, I kind of get the impression I should have been here a little while ago. Got lucky. That village is still much more effective, uh, a much more effective loop. Alright, I know I'm about to get shot at again. Ow! Stand here until he shoots again. He's got to run out of bullets sometime. Okay, grab this and get out, get out, get out. Yep. I knew the bullets were coming. Dude, you've got endless bullets. Why don't you deal with the monster problem? I know you're probably cor corrupted by all the blood or whatever, but, like, dude. Uh, this is old Yarnum. It fell to the monsters forever ago, despite my gatling gun. There was nothing I could do to stop it, except for all the things I could have done. What in the world is that? I am not a fan of that sound. Oh, it's this dude again. Oh, I cannot deal with you. It's a sucking less? On it. I cannot deal with him with that dude friggin' shooting at me from above. So that's okay. I just lost a bunch of a bunch of echoes, but that's alright. I can very easily farm those back at the village. I just need to get back to where I was pretty quick. What's up, champion? How you doing? Hmm. This get there quick method is not working out well for me. <laughs> Oops. <sighs> All right. So, we're going to we're still going to have to deal with some of this crap. It took me so long to get to that dude, I've kind of forgotten the route already. Nope. Crap, man. I went through here. And then I went down here? Yes. Okay. Uh, then through here. Mm -hmm. and, oh, I did not come out here. I missed an item. Alright. Well, at least we got to re-explore. Take that, air! Yeah, I get it. You can see me through the door. Relax. I was so happy for founding a cup for having found a couple of blood vials and just instant death. I 
I spit hot fire. So you gonna stop? Fine, fine, fine. Alright, now we're back here at least. So we're pretty close to where we died. It's all about the learning. I feel like I should try to skip these guys, but I don't think I can afford to. I definitely do not want to go back the same way I, I went last time. I can't handle that dude with him shooting at me. Man, I got poisoned pretty good there. Rats. At least I think that's poison. Alright, we're not going down that bridge. Oh, we might have to. Ah, poop nuggets. Alright. Let's hang a left instead of going right. To the right is death. A lot of interesting moans and groans coming from this building. The big old room, too. Okay. Hmm. Okay, I can't do that. I was kind of hoping, but oh well. Like that. Uh, okay. I'm not grabbing that thing on the altar until I've dealt with all these. Let's just dodge a bunch, get an opening, and then go for it. This dude straight up got an infestation. I heard something else. Yeah. Like, there's still something else around here. Alright, let's grab this. See what we got. Ritual blood. Okay. Let's explore the rest of the room first. Uh, what is that thing? Strike one, you're out! What keeps screeching at me? Everything in this room is dead. Well, except for me. All right, so we have to leave through this door. Can't wait to see where he's firing on me from. Lots of blood vials. That goes up. This goes over here. I mean, I feel like I definitely need to go up to deal with this dude with the gun. I just don't know whether it's actually the right thing to do or not. I mean, it's not like I'm carrying a ton of Echoes right now, so the only real risk is time. 
If I die, I have to make my way back here all over again. I hit hit with the heavy. Yeah, there he is. Okay. Crap. Uh, trying to get down here. Leave me alone. Or follow me. Thank you. There was a bunch of free hits. I dig that. Oh, I really shouldn't be trying to engage that dude. Did he just heal himself? Ah, that's this. Okay. Yes, he did. I'm not fighting you on that platform, dude. But down here? Sure. Oh. Down he goes. Too bad it's too late for him to drop the echoes I lost to him, but... Alright. So, da 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 We did that. That led me up here. So do we need to explore this way or no? No. Okay, this is okay. So that's that's the that's a loop there. What we didn't get to do was see what's beyond this dude because he killed me the last time I fought him. There is something unsettling to the idea of a crow that barks like a dog. Gotta take this Joker out. He's so annoying. What? Oh, there's a ladder here. Oh my gosh. I could have dealt with him forever ago. I just didn't know how to get up to his building. There's no way to combine those two words into one in a way that makes sense. I like where your head's at, though. It's 
like a dance. This is taking too long. I'm gonna miss the farmer's market. No, 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 no. Hyperion Dang asks, it. why die when you can respawn? Oh. I did. I had that guy on lockdown. I was not expecting him to knock me off the building, and I knew... As soon as I dodged to the side there, I was like, uh, this is dangerous, this is dangerous, don't be here. But I couldn't do anything. Ah, this is the way down. Yeah, blah, blah, blah. Oh, hi. Okay. And we're running, and we're running, and we're dodging all the things by accident. Oh, cool. So glad I got to spend some time with an exploding barrel. It was just what I wanted. Oh, hi. And ladder. Oh no, he's climbing. <gasps> they can climb? I didn't know that. I didn't know they knew how to climb! What is that nonsense? The likelihood of you dying violently within the next five minutes is 87.61%. What's up, Yomega? How you doing tonight? I got to I'm starting to kind of get a get a taste for these hunter fights. They feel like dances. I kind of dig it. I think I'm getting my toes stepped on in this particular dance. That's why I was kind of panicked about, like, they can climb? better last time. He was almost dead! <sighs> One of the things I really like about Bloodborne is that I know there's like uber advanced gameplay for this for this game. Um, like, I was doing research on, like, the stats before, and they were just like, oh, yeah, these two stats. Don't touch them unless you know what you're doing, because otherwise they won't do anything for you. Like, advanced gameplay is something that I really respect in a game, and I know Bloodborne's got it. That being said, I'm still an extremely beginner slash novice player, and I'm not ready for any of that mess. Um, but I still appreciate that I, that, that exists. I am sure... That there are people out there who have got, like, some of the strategies for these bosses on lockdown, like, no hit such and such, or whatever. Strategies for every boss. 
using like this crazy nuance with with weapons with this weapon or that weapon or what have you. But I gotta tell you, like I feel oh crap, I feel dead. I feel dead inside. Um, I I feel most at home with the standard Hunter X. I feel like it's got a great balance between its heavy attacks and its light attacks. Despite all my rage, I am just a guy who plays video games during the day for fun and does a poorly man in a cage. Yeah. I'm getting worse. Uh, I almost had that dude the first time. If only I hadn't accidentally st stepped to the side of the building. about you and what's worse is he's not even a boss he's just trash oh okay then here and then up the ladder and see if someone follows me yep they're gonna follow me again I climb one hand, one foot. Oh, what the? Oh, they both followed me. All right, time to get my butt handed to me again. Hello. Is your name Gilly? I'm here from UPS. I'm here to deliver your butt. Uh. No. I'm dead. I didn't know he'd hit me well, so hard. I needed to the heal. Next time you dream, give some thought. I cannot wait to shut this dude up. I think it would. I think dying would bother me less if it wasn't such a run back associated to it. I can deal with the brute. The brutalness of this game it's difficulty but the the run back is like salt in the wound it's entirely unnecessary did from software do Elden ring i for, I, I don't know who published it I hope they keep that up. Like the having to farm for 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 levels or for echoes and farming for blood vials and stuff does not bother me. Um, easier to kill them down there. Are you about to follow me? Good. Um. It's the run back. Like, I, I've run into this problem before. Like, I get sensitive to the fact that I'm running a stream here. A stream with a very limited time frame. I don't have all this time to be running back here and wasting like two minutes per attempt just getting back to the boss. I don't have a choice because I'm playing this game, but it's annoying. I'd rather just get back in the action.
No, this isn't where I want to be. Yeah, I'm with you on that, buddy. I was healing! Keg Hunter badge? Oh, oh, come on! I don't understand what I just got. Oh, right there. I like these dance fights. I almost had them the first time I fought them. I just fell off the edge of the building. There's got to be more in Old Yarnum than this dude. I thought I was going to get kind of close to doing that before, but I didn't want him to live. So, if I kill him, is he dead? Like, he won't... It seems to me that whenever I kill a hunter, they don't respawn, even if I use a lantern. That seems to be what I've noticed. It's just the beasts. Okay. Still don't know what that is. Well, dead in Bloodborne is not necessarily dead. Well, I've already learned I can't go that way. There's no other way to go. I, I don't know how to get to those two things. And there's a higher up. Is that moaning just from the people down below? Oh, I see you fools spawn in here too. Oops, I didn't know you could reach that far. Ah! It's just kind of one of those, like, oh, hey, Jim. Ah! <laughs> okay. I didn't go this way. Yeah, the moaning stops when I engage them. So it's got to be them that's doing that. Yeah, I see you. Did you think I didn't see you? They brought the party to me. Anybody else want to negotiate? Well, at 
least I'm getting blood vials out of it. Um, slow poisoning. That's no bueno. Okay. Uh, I was hoping he dropped blood vials. Lame! I can't open this door from the other side. And the moaning's definitely stopped. It's definitely them. We already got that. So we just did this loop again. For no reason. Why do you say that, Doc? I can tell you, Ari has been hooked on Pokemon Snap. She has been playing the crap out of that game. She tried Stardew Valley um, and did not like it. Oh, I see. Have I been here before? She said she didn't appreciate the way that felt like the game was wasting her time. Where it was like, um, oh, so-and-so wants an apple, so you gotta go, like, all the way out of the way to give this person an apple. Well, um, I'm hoping that uh, Fix is able to maintain this, but he's, uh, he had mentioned earlier about doing uh, another Among Us stream on the, or an another Among Us game on the weekend of the 4th. Um, and Ari might join in. She has never played before, which means the I don't know where anything on the map is excuse is back on the table. It should be fun. Where, what is this? I have, I know I'm in old Yarnum, but I have no idea where I am right now. It does not open from this side. Okay. This game needs a map so freaking bad. No, I want her to have the excuse. <laughs> See, hiding in a shack in PUBG is one of RA's defining moments. I tried to record, and for some reason my shadow play wasn't working at the time. I tried to record Ari's first ever PUBG game. And she was in full, like, rabbit prey mode. She was so scared. And I was like, hey, I'm going to go outside and look for, like, more weapons and stuff. And she was just, like, proned in a room somewhere. And she's like, all right, have fun dying. Like, she was 100% terrified. I so wish I had the video of that. It was hilarious. Well, I mean, sure. It could use a nap, too. Everybody in this game could really could really just, you know, zen out a little bit. Relax. Everybody around here is all worked up. Now, see... Among Us can be, can be worrisome in a paranoid sort of way. You never know who around is trying to kill you. But Among Us is really about how good of a liar you are. Uh, when you're the imposter. 
It's how good you are deducing and how good of a liar you are. That's and how clever your strategies are. So I'm not expecting a, a, a PUBG equivalent with Ari. What I worry about with Ari is a sturf like equivalent where Ari does not unmute herself during the discussions because she's too busy laughing. But hey, as long as everybody's having a good time, I'm happy. That night of Among Us was a blast. Uh, hype zone. Hot zone shack moment? Hot zone? You're dead. I've been up here before. Okay. So now we're back to the entrance of Old Yarnum. Was that the only point of, our, of Old Yarnum killing that dude? It can't be. Um, yeah. Oh, Ari is listening. She just texted me, I will destroy you all. We'll see. Hot seat. Um, all right. We're done for the night. Uh, the exploration of Old Yarnum was fun, but ultimately it still didn't lead any anywhere. Like, I'm feeling very... Del del Oh, Doc says he's not afraid of you. Um, the gauntlet has been thrown down. I'm still feeling very directionless in this game. Uh, I don't know where to go. I don't know what to do. Uh, I'm probably going to look up a Bloodborne map uh, offline to see if I can get some form of direction and where to go next. And I probably will take the opportunity to explore Old Yarnum a bit offline, to, just to make sure I didn't miss anything. But, we are done with Bloodborne tonight. Let me go ahead and exit the game.